Hello friends! Welcome to the example presentation for the Young Tagore Contest. You can find more about the Young Tagore Contest in the description below. I am Meghna and I study at Ryan International School, Sector 40 Gurugram. Let's watch a presentation by Sai Shivani from Ryan Banargatta, Bangalore. Her favorite book is The Adventure of Sherlock Holmes. Over to Sai Shivani. Hello everyone. I am Sai Shivani from Ryan International School, Banargatta, Bangalore. Today, I am going to tell you all about my favorite book. Let me give you a few hints. Can you guess it? The first clue is the Victorian era, the era in which the book was published. Clue number two is the doorstep of the house of the main character, 221B. The third clue is the main character always wears a cap, holds a pipe and has a magnifying glass. Yes, you are right. My favourite book is The Adventures of Sherlock Holmes, written by Sir Arthur Conan Doyle, a British writer and a physician who takes us into the world of investigation of crimes through the fictional detective, Sherlock Holmes, supported by his best friend, assistant and flatmate, Dr. Watson. Watson tries to match Holmes with his intelligence but doesn't seem to reach his level. They live in 221B Baker Street, a fictional address of London which has a special place in the hearts of millions of Sherlock Holmes fans. It is now a museum that thousands of people visit every day. Guys, all this started when I was feeling bored just by watching TV and playing video games. The constant motivation from my teachers to read books and the way my father narrated the story of Sherlock Holmes sparked an interest within me to read this book. Out of all the short stories in my favourite book, The Adventures of Sherlock Holmes, my favourites are the Red-Headed League, The Hound of the Baskervilles, The Adventure of the Most Grave Ritual, The Adventure of the Greek Interpreter and my most favourite short story from my favourite book is The Speckled Band. The Speckled Band is a detective story to entertain us with mystery. The story is told in a way that puzzles us and frightens us. In this there are two sisters, Helen and Julia. Their mother is no more, but left a lot of money for them. Their stepfather, Dr. Grimsby Royal Art, wants all the money his daughter's mother left for himself. And to add, he has reptiles and animals from India. For what? What is the connection between Indian animals and him getting the money? That's the mystery that you have to find out by reading the book. The lessons that influenced me the most are thinking outside the box, determination, getting into the root cause and the moral as we always read as kids, what you sow, so shall you reap. I recommend you all to read my favourite book, The Adventures of Sherlock Holmes, because you get to be a real life detective. Like I found my grandpa's missing spectacles, my mom's diary, my father's mobile phone, my cousin's earring and much more guys. That brings me to the end of my presentation. Thank you. This was a great presentation about Sherlock Holmes stories and I'm so impressed that Sai has become a detective in real life. She was speaking with the right speed and it was easy to follow her. We can easily make out she practiced her speech very well. Now it's your turn friends. 
take it out there and make some amazing presentation for the Young Tiger Contest. Friends, if you liked our video, then don't forget to give us a like, comment or share. Thanks for watching. Bye.